Hello, Joanne. Hello. Hello. What do you need from me today? Oh. It's not a check, is it? It's not. Okay, good. Because I have no money in the bank. You want me to sit down over here and wait? Okay. Used to be when I'd walk, walk with my wife, you know, I'd think, wow, okay, we are getting over, we're walking together. And we'd go out there, and we'd walk about two to three miles, and it would feel great, I would. But then I would come in, and when I'd get to stand up, my knee would sometimes pop. You know, nothing bad, just like, you know, that little quick pop, and it was very sore. Then I tried it on the treadmill to see, oh, well, that'll be better. That really was worse. I stopped everything. As far as all I do is, you know, controlled workouts that I can control everything. Okay, that looks pretty good. Okay. All right, very good. Good way, Doc. Thank you, man. Good <laughs> right, to see good you. Good to see you too. Look great, too. Right. What's your name? Stephanie. Stephanie, good to see you. Are you going to help me out today a little? I am. How are you today? I'm, I'm good. Great, great Good great seeing point. you again, Phil. Good seeing you, Doc. We're going to have a seat right here in the chair. All right. And uh, we'll start with your right knee. So we're going to take this one over here so I don't hit you with this machine. This okay. is the uh, fluoroscopic machine, the moving x-ray. It gives me uh, x-ray vision, so I'm Superman. I never miss. Mm, okay. <laughs> you hide it well, Superman. <laughs> So you can see all three elements of your knee, your kneecap or your patella, your thigh bone or your femur and your tibia or okay. your shin bone. Wow. And that's where you had the surgery before. Right. So I'm not doing anything. I'm just gonna see where I'm going first. Okay. Perfect, absolutely perfect. So that just gives me a, a guide post. Okay. I can see everything where I'm going. And now we're just gonna clean. This is just like alcohol, uh, not the good kind. I don't drink. Oh, okay. Well, not every day. <laughs> <laughs> and now this is a cold spray. It's just right. like putting an ice cube on your skin. Good. Mm. That is absolutely perfect. Need to get some of that. Just a little pinch. Oh, no. <laughs> Don't you dare. No, it doesn't hurt. You can't really even feel it, but I don't want to look. No, you don't want to look. It's yeah. just like drawing blood, you know? Yeah. You can get just turn your in. head and wait till, oh, good. No pain. There you go. It's amazing, really. And that was it. Needles that long going into my knee and you never feel it. So, that's great. Yeah, that's awesome. great. It's really not uh, the length of the needle. It's, you know, like how big it is that, right. that you know, hurts you or not. Mm. Well, if this makes it better than last week, then we're off to a great start. It will. It will yeah. get a little better every single week. Mm. Awesome. Yeah, that's exciting. So now we're just going to... Switch. Switch, okay. There you go, perfect. Absolutely perfect. You watch, you watch the needle go into your knee when they do it? No. No. I think everybody's that way, right? Everybody, Yeah. everybody. You know, sometimes I tell patients, just close your eyes, go to the beach, you know, think about that uh, pina colada with the umbrella in it. Wow, you've been there the way you described this. <laughs> You didn't go this morning, I hope. And some people, some people will watch up here. They can do that, but they don't oh. want to see down here. Yeah. So it's just different for everybody. Mm. So exactly the same way every time, cleaning, cleaning more. My wife needs to do this for real. She does because her knees do bother her. Okay. But as soon as you, she'd have to, we'd have to put blinders on her. <laughs> because and since, then you have to hold her hand. So as soon as she sees a needle, she goes, I can't do that. <laughs> And you know, I hope I'm doing, I'm preventing my knees from getting bad. And I do watch everything I do. I walk, I work out a little, I try to take care, I try to eat right, Every I do all that stuff. And uh, Well remember, we told you you're a grade three on the right, grade right. two on the left. And osteoarthritis is a chronic, indolent, progressive disease. There's no cure. 
even this is not a cure, but it does prevent the progression of the disease. Well, that's, that's it. Yeah. Yeah. I'm, for once, I'm ahead of schedule. <laughs> Instead of waiting until like, oh, you mean. So this is what this is what's great about it. I'm really I'm excited and see where it goes. And... Hey, Jennifer, is yeah, that your name? Jennifer. Okay, good. Nice, nice to see you. I'm Phil. You. Good to see you. I think I'm going to start trying to play golf a little more. Uh, I, I haven't played. I was a good golfer, but I haven't even hit a ball or done anything probably for at least 10 years, maybe up to 15. And the biggest thing is I want to play tennis again, but not on hard surface, on hard true, something that gives a little mm -hmm. to try and see how that works out. And after walking with the brace and not having any pain or discomfort, and I kept trying it out like going, oh, what if I was playing tennis? And gave me belief that I can probably do that. And I want to do it to beat my daughter. So that's, <laughs> awesome. that's the main that objective. Is <laughs> that is Because she says she can beat me. Okay, very good. Not a chance. <laughs> so we'll see.